He started his work 20 years ago as an environmental researcher and developer. His main goal was to create a clean transportation system for the future. Eight years ago, he registered the world's first advanced intelligent electric vehicle in Europe. Today, Jamshid Aryan is well known for his IEVs across Europe and Australia. The problem of the electric car is, is the time for charging the battery take a six to eight hour. And uh, this is why maybe the, the OEM, the car manufacturer, never go to, to mass production. So I just think how we can, we can invent it, the, uh, new, the new vehicle. We can charge quickly. In uh, between two to six minutes, we can provide enough energy for, for the car and you can drive 300 kilometers or 400 kilometers. It took him only three months to build and introduce the first version of his IEV, the Ariana 792, back in 2001. Ariane has brought his latest invention with him all the way from Belgium to his other workshop situated in the Anzali Special Economic Zone on the coast of the Caspian Sea. Well, here we are in, in the, the castle of the Caspian Sea. It, it is my country and, and part of the country and the beautiful uh, area and I think how we can protect the environment and we can start it uh, from this point, from this area. The latest Ariana is in fact fit itself into GM's 2008 Opel Tigra, calling itself IEV Tigra. I have three prototypes or so, like Ariana 792, Ariana 796 and Ariana 800. We are designed and built from ground to whole body. Uh, uh, but why we put the system in this brand? Because we want to show the, the technology you know, we, can, we can put in any other car. And if some of our innovators have their way, our petrol costs could be slashed. When it comes to battery power, cars don't get much better than this. Jim Adrian is the inventor of the world first intelligent electric car. It has enough power to travel up to 300 kilometers and can recharge itself in just six minutes. The batteries provide adequate energy for the vehicle to produce a top speed of 160 kilometers per hour. But perhaps the most appealing part of Jamshid Aryan's invention is his unique method by which he charges or recharges his intelligent electric vehicles. There are two ways through which you can recharge this IEV. First is to simply attach the car to the electricity at your home or in your office. And in this way, you will be able to get this car recharged within six hours. But there is also another way, and that is to refer to an intelligent charging station where you can get enough energy to run this car for more than 300 kilometers in just a period of between three to six minutes, all with the equipment that lies underneath this hood. Situated inside the R&D department of IEV Ariana Company in Brussels, the intelligent charging station is capable of charging the vehicle using a robotic charger or a fully automatic battery exchange system without human operation. The entire process will only take about three to six minutes. This option could be the key to fulfilling Ariane's dream, that is to make the use of IEVs easy for everyone, everywhere. Driving a piece of technology can be fun, especially when you know you're not harming any of the precious gifts of Mother Nature. This vehicle is completely noise-free. The only noise that you can hear is the friction between the tires and the road. It's incredible. Every time you take your foot off the gas pedal, the car automatically starts to recharge the battery, enabling it to go longer distances, depending less on charging stations. Ariane's vision goes beyond the production of a noise and emission-free vehicle that is easy to use worldwide. His concern for the environment has stretched the boundaries of his imagination to places where only a few minds have traveled. Ariane has introduced his latest idea, which he calls the E4 program, 
a local pilot project known as the Caspian Sea Solution. We have a building, a special building. We produce electricity from solar and wind turbine. And then we have a storage system. And then we have an intelligent charge station. So we are going to have everything together, work together. People can live, can drive and uh, work in, in clean environments without uh, pollution, without uh, noise pollution also. Aryan has big ambitions inside his mind. He is looking forward to mass producing his vehicles inside Iran. He is confident in what he's doing and dreams of a day that the world would be less dependent on oil. A world where all the skies are blue and people can live in a clean natural environment. I'm Yemeti Kazemi, Press TV for Iran.